Over the years, large dogs have been a great treasure to dog owners with great qualities besides their intimidating size. These dogs make the perfect hunters, watchmen, and defenders. But they've also proven to be amazing bloodhounds, shepherds, and even babysitters. Most importantly, these dogs make very loyal friends to their owners. And so, in today's video, we will be looking at the top 15 largest dog breeds you probably never heard about. Sit back, get comfortable, and let's find out who's on the list, shall we? 15. Hungarian Commodore Coming up at number 15 is the Hungarian Commodore. This dog that very easily resembles a giant sheep is a fierce guardian yet a sweet pal for experienced dog owners. But watch out now, because these guys can quickly go from zero to a hundred. While they are generally cool, calm, and collected, they will easily spring into action the second they sense any danger in a bid to guard their home and loved ones. Their long white coat allows them to easily blend in with a flock of sheep, hence making them terrific shepherds. Plus, this breed is very calm and affectionate, making devoted companions for their owners. The Hungarian Commodore has an average height that ranges from 65 to 80 centimeters, and they tend to weigh an average of about 50 kilograms. 14. Black Russian Terrier At number 14 is the Black Russian Terrier. This Russian breed was some kind of experiment in the USSR when the government requested the Red Star Kennel to create a dog breed that could weather literally any storm. To create this breed, they combine giant schnauzers, rottweilers, Newfoundlands, and Caucasian shepherds, among others, and the product was the Black Russian Terrier, a dog with insane physical strength, powerful jaws and teeth, and gigantic proportions. The Black Russian Terrier stands tall at about 66 to 78 centimeters, and they would usually weigh about 63 kilograms. As furry and elegant as these dogs are, they do an excellent job searching for drugs and explosives in the Russian service. They also make excellent guard dogs to protect territories. While these dogs are brave, self-confident, and calm, they can sometimes get stubborn and lazy. It's just the perfect balance to fit into a loving family. 13. Irish Wolfhound the Irish Wolfhound is popularly known as the tallest dog in the world. In the early times, these dogs were bred to pull men off their high horses and chariots in battle. But today, the Irish Wolfhound is known to be a great family companion. Irish Wolfhound owners do not fail to take full advantage of their intelligence as they use them in different hunting and obedience competitions. Interestingly, this breed is excellent with kids and they also tend to socialize with other animals. Unfortunately, this friendly nature makes them terrible guard dogs. However, given that not many people know this, their size is enough to intimidate intruders. An Irish wolfhound generally stands at about 85 centimeters, while weighing about 55 kilograms. 12. Newfoundland This breed is basically a large working dog that was initially bred for the sole purpose of pulling fishing nets and lumber in Newfoundland. Newfoundlands are powerful water-loving dogs with a really big heart, and they make perfect family companions. They are very soft with children and are always ready to watch out for their loved ones. Newfoundlands can easily pass as people pleasers with an incredible work ethic. We must add that this is, in fact, a brilliant breed, making them easy to train. On average, Newfoundlands stand tall at 63 to 75 centimeters, with an average weight of about 75 kilograms. 11. Turkish Kangal The Turkish Kangal is one dog that stays committed to protecting its owner and all they own. However, they share their soft side with other pets and even kids, so much so that they make perfect babysitters. That aside, Kangles are insanely strong dogs and are even considered one of the strongest dogs in the world. Some countries today still use this breed to protect cattle from predators such as cheetahs and wolves. 
Overall, this is a breed you definitely will enjoy around your home. However, with such comes the great responsibility of proper exercise. Also, their enormous size makes it impossible for them to live inside an apartment. So, this might not be the best breed for you if you don't have plenty of yard space. For context, the Turkish Kangal stands at about 71 to 81 centimeters, and its weight ranges from 46 to 65 kilograms. 10. Borzoi The Borzoi breed is one of the oldest dog breeds that date as far back as the 17th century. Unlike the other dogs we've seen so far, the Borzoi is not as muscular. However, it is a graceful, slender, and tall dog. As a hunting breed, the Borzoi possesses many qualities that allow it to hunt perfectly. This includes outstanding senses, from their perfect vision to their swift reaction, to an insane speed that allows them to run up to about 60 kilometers per hour. The Borzoi is a susceptible and calm dog that can quickly flip into an aggressive dog at the first sight of danger or potential danger. Considering how skinny these guys are, they tend not to weigh so much, with about 42 to 52 kilograms. However, these are very tall dogs, standing at about 75 to 87 centimeters. 9. Great Dane At number 9 is the Great Dane or, as it is popularly called, the Gentle Giant. The primary purpose of breeding this dog was initially to hunt wild boar. And although the Great Dane is known for its intimidating looks, this breed is actually very gentle, sweet, and soft, especially with children. Unfortunately, the size of an average Great Dane makes it almost impossible for them to be proper house dogs. So, if you are going to have them around the home, you have to be able to dedicate time to training your Great Dane. This breed is literally considered the tallest dog in the world, and rightfully so, as they stand tall at 110 centimeters, while weighing about 75 kilograms. 8. Bernese Mountain Dog The Bernese Mountain Dog is a Russian breed that is one of the best watch and guard dogs you can have around. Once it notices a potential threat, it doesn't give up until it finishes it off. That's just one of the ways it shows its loyalty to loved ones. The Bernese Mountain Dog is ever ready to make independent decisions, hence the need for proper training, else you may find it very hard to handle them once they become adults. This breed stands at about 58 to 66 centimeters while weighing about 38 to 50 kilograms. 7. Cubas Like our number 8, this breed at number 7 is ready to fight to the death to protect its owner or territory. This alone makes Cubas outstanding guards and watchdogs. Cubas are hound dogs that require a lot of respect in return for their perpetual loyalty. These are not dogs you should go for if you are a first-time dog owner, as they will quickly tire you out due to how much they enjoy their freedom. Also, having this breed in a tight home will be a terrible idea as they tend to grow to about 66 to 76 centimeters tall while weighing about 62 kilograms. 6. St. Bernard Number 6 is one that many consider one of the biggest dogs with the most tender hearts. These dogs were initially bred to rescue travelers and guard travel lodges in the Swiss Alps. Indeed, this breed is very intelligent and muscular and ticks all the boxes for the job requirements. But regardless of its huge size, a typical St. Bernard would rather enjoy its time indoors with their loved ones. Their ever-friendly nature allows them to be in the house and not bother anyone, as they'll happily lie down and sleep while everyone goes on with their lives. Overall, St. Bernard's grow to about 65 to 85 centimeters while weighing 110 kilograms. 5. Caucasian Shepherd The Caucasian Shepherd is another dog that dates back to antiquity. For this breed, Fear is a foreign concept. They are determined and are not friendly with strangers. Already, you can tell that Caucasian Shepherds make perfect guard dogs, but even more, these dogs are very smart and love to be independent. 
Therefore, they must be trained from their puppy stage. Otherwise, it will be difficult to handle them as adults. On average, a Caucasian Shepherd can grow to about 75 centimeters tall while weighing about 80 kilograms. 4. Borbol The Borbol is a South African breed dating back to the mid-1600s and is majorly used as a guard dog. The name Borbol roughly translates to farm dog, and in the early years, this breed served as a protector to the Dutch and British settlers in Cape Town. Today, this breed is mostly always seen with very experienced owners with a comfortable space and a lot of time on their hands. These dogs require a tremendous amount of supervision. And in some areas, owning one of these bad boys is even considered illegal. Borbols tend to grow as tall as 70 centimeters while weighing about 90 kilograms. 3. Tibetan Mastiff This pure breed was initially bred to be guard dogs for people's property and livestock. But despite that fact, the Tibetan Mastiff makes a great companion that quickly gets attached to their loved ones and wants to be around them all the time. Mind you, this breed's protective instinct doesn't allow it to blend with kids. It also makes it difficult for them to trust strangers. Even more, these dogs very quickly become territorial once they sense a threat. And so, due to these factors, new dog owners may want to avoid the Tibetan Mastiff. These massive beasts grow to about 85 centimeters tall and weigh about 90 kilogram. 2. Spanish Mastiff At number 2 is the Spanish Mastiff, which is easily considered one of the heaviest dogs in the world. The Spanish Mastiff dates back over a couple thousand years, and they are well known for their size and the massive fold to skin that hang off their neck. Although they are yet to be recognized by the American Kennel Club, the Spanish Mastiff has been assigned the working dog group in the AKC's Foundation Stock Service since 2008. These beasts are usually about 87 centimeters tall and weigh about 115 kilograms. 1. English Mastiff And finally, at number 1 is the world's largest breed, the English Mastiff. This giant Mastiff, which was originally bred for the war, remains one of the most gigantic and oldest dogs on earth. Although the ancient Mastiffs were war dogs, what we have today are soft-hearted and passive dogs. This breed makes a great companion to experienced dog owners who can accommodate their size and wouldn't mind them drooling everywhere. But above all, this breed has a lot of love to go around. The English Mastiff stands tall at about 90 centimeters and weighs 120 kilograms. If you enjoyed the video, be sure to smash that like button. And for more content like this, don't forget to subscribe to the channel and ring the notification bell so you never miss an upload. Thank you for watching.